Now, the ownership status of the Taita Sisal estate land in Mwatete, Taita Taveta County, is now in the public knowledge after the company director, Philip Kiriazi, through the company advocate, shared with the public the list of companies owned since 1927 to date. The Sisal company uh, occupies four parcels of land with a total of 30,000. 284 acres. This came after the company announced the selling of 3,000 acres amid ownership concerns by a section of community and leaders. Our reporter, Hezron Kimari, has documented the story of the Taita estate land ownership and now reports. 1927 with a lease of 999 years. The farm's ownership kept on changing since its formation until 1973 when Philip Keriaz's family bought it after it was placed under receivership. According to a report shared with the public in Voi, Charles Sidney Goldman was the first owner of LR number 3880 and 3881 since 1st April 1927 before selling it to Tata Concessions Limited on 16 May 1929. On 29 June 1953, the land was taken by Ngerenye Plantation Limited until July 1961 when Tata Sisal Estate Limited took it. In August 1963, the farm was taken over by the Regional Assembly and later changed hands to TNT Sisal Company Limited on May 1964. Tata Estate took over ownership since 19th April 1973 to date under Philip Keriazi as the director. The report further states that parcel number 6924 was first owned by Charles Sidney Goldman from 1st May 1930 to 12 October 1932 when Taita Consensus Limited took over. In July 1961, Taita Sisal Estates Limited owned the land until 30 May 1964 before the ownership shifted to TNT Sisal Company Limited. But the farm has been under Taita Estates since 13 April 1973 to date. The report shows that parcel number 9487 was owned by Taita Consensus Limited from 1st January 1950 to 4th July 1964 when TNT Sisal Company took it. Later on 16th April 1973, Taita Sisal Estate bought the farm. Again, parcel number 11378 was owned by Taita Sisal Estate Limited from 1st July 1963 to 30th May 1964 when TNT Sisal Company Limited took it and later was sold to Taita Sisal Estate on 13th April 1973 So kama tumemaliza Tanzania tulifika Kenya banki lile tulikuwa nafanya kazi Tanzania wali waliona kwamba mzee anaweza kufanya hii kazi wali muuliza kuje akwe manager ya hizi shamba zitolewe kutoka pahali wapi walikuwa. <coughs> okay? So, 66, pata 72, ilikuwa 71, lakini ilikuwa very late 71. So, wali, wali maliza lile madeni zote 72. Na hiyo ni kwanini nasema 1972 in brackets. Wafam? Uh, just so you understand. Staki mutu wa semu, oh, unajua hii kitu na nit. Ah, sio hivyo. Hii ni lile historia kutoka vile inatokea. Okay? Na unaweza kuuliza, it's public information, kuuliza company's house, wakupatia zile majina za hizo makampani zote, my director zao. Kampuni nazo ziko the same way. TNT, ngerenyi, <coughs> Taita concessions, how ni watu tofauti mbele ya sheria. Tumelewana? Hata shareholders wenye kampuni, shareholders wenye kampuni, directors ni tofauti. Hakuna uhusiano na Taita Estates Limited. Taita concessions limited wakamuzia Taita Sizon Estates Limited mwaka 1961. Hizi tarehe, sijiatawa kwa kichwa, nimetawa kwa records za serikali. A section of the community living around Singila Majengo, which borders the Taita Sisal estate, has been embroiled in a boundary dispute with the investor for some time now. In September 2017, former Land CS Professor Jacob Kaimeni signed and approved a report by the Parliamentary Lands Committee on the boundary dispute. The finding of the report further stated that 
Taita estate had not encroached on the community land. Instead, a section of the community was blamed for encroachment. So the survey work was completed within two weeks with the following outputs or outcome. So, so all the boundary beacons for the four parcels of land in question were searched. Most of the beacons were found intact and the few not found in place were re-established as per survey regulations. The total acreage of the land is 30,284 acres as indicated on the survey maps for the four parcels. Second recommendation was or comment was the Sison estate was operating within within the four parcels and had not encroached onto the neighboring community land, road, trust land around Tasha Hill and railway reserves. The community has encroached onto parts of the Sison estate including Singila Majengo sections along the Voi Mwatate Road. Actually the boundary of Mwatate municipality is the boundary of Taita Estates Limited. <coughs> so Taita Estates Limited, in terms of geographical coverage of your proposed land use plan of Matate, is covered <coughs> as a municipality. During a public engagement forum with Taita Estate in Voi, several concerns were raised by the public seeking clarification about the lease period of the 3,000 acres of land on sale. Mbayo yu hati miliki mama haikuwa na ekari elfu salasini. Ilikuwa na ekari elfu stini. Ndiposa ngerenyi plantations limited walichukua ekari kadha na yu title nde ikaenda na hiyo sehemu. So, this report by Obel, as far as I'm concerned, where he was complaining uh, uh, about the amalgamation of the report and how their reports were not taken into account, I just all want us all to agree that there was an issue. And that's why the, the numbers of the same title have changed from zero to stroke one to stroke two to stroke. Every time the government changed it, the Ministry of Lands changed it. The Ministry of Lands changed it. It wasn't the, it wasn't the Shamba who changed it. It was the Ministry who did it then then change the position of the farm so as not to encroach onto where the indigenous state has lived, worked, and, and, and did their work. So it was deemed that it had to be moved further south. So it consistently was being moved. The resident father proposed that the investor considers reducing the price of the 50 by 100 plots from 270,000 and the six month payment period be extended. So today we have had a very successful meeting because all the issues which we were raising concerning the tenure of the land, the approval processes, and even for the fair value concerning the valuation have been addressed. And so it behoves us as the leaders of this community then to sit down and see how best we can proceed as a community. Tungependelea kwamba tujiangalie sisi watu wataita taveta na tujiulize kama kweli shamba inauzwa. Hii karobo ni an eighth. It is an eighth, not, not, not a quarter. An eighth. I think it is very small for the price that is being quoted. If really we want to be inclusive about the people of Taita Taveta. Tuliamua kwama wadugu tuapatie mataita. Iji ali. Tuapatie na, ma, na title. Lakini tufanye kitu moja tujenge town ya mana. Tujenge kitu tunaweza kusema ime saida, saidia county kuliko ime irudisha nyuma. Taita Estate is one of the largest sisal plantation farms in the region. It has been the nerve of the economy in Taita Veta County. The farm has employed many locals with more secondary economic dependence. It has also been issuing bursaries and supporting football clubs. Some residents of Taita Veta have already shown interest in purchasing the sisal land. Hezron Kimari, KTN News, Mwatate, Taita Veta County. Now, many questions arise on whether Kenyan police actually abide by the rule of law. And also